That's Killer Casey. I've known her since 2017. She's at grinding away on the uh, couple welds on the front of that Camaro. And all the lead work is done. And just doing a couple small touch up items. And um, she's working on the third door for the 49 Chevrolet right now. <clears throat> Making a new piece for the bottom here because this was all rotted out. Here's the old one right here. I cut it off and removed it and then blasted it just to determine where we need to go on that. And she's making the piece right here for the 49, which is good. And this thing is about ready to go back to the owner, this Camaro. So whenever he paints it, the body man can put just a little bit of uh, just a little small skim uh, body filler on here, and it'd be good to go. Same thing right here where I had to cut the quarter and widen it just a little bit to make sure the gaps were okay. Just gonna load this up now and secure it on the trailer. Get it, uh, get it out of here. So Case is pretty good at doing this kind of stuff. She's able to figure stuff out really quickly, which is good. So 49 doesn't get a lot of media attention, but that's gonna change because this now moves up to um, you know, moves up in priority because that is now gone. So, plan is tomorrow morning get the um, the body fully mounted to the frame and bolted in, so we know that is good. We know that that is correct. And mount the doors, the doors that are done, and then um, get the other door done. And um, I'll probably go over, take out some of those areas that the Bondo was replacing the lead. And I'll put some lead in that. And, um, you know, blow this car apart again. Um, take the uh, frame, you know, get it, get it blasted and get it powder coated. Get a new rear end for it. Um, you know, and then start building it. But uh, rust is really a killer. Rust is horrible. Rust destroys cars and it takes three to five times as much time to fix something that's really rusty versus something that is uh, not rusty, of course. Now I just got another uh, Porsche 928 intake manifold arrived today from a guy up in Utah. I'm gonna get this thing blasted and put it in the same silver vein color that the last one was in. And my little rotisserie up there is gonna get some use again. So I'll be blasting some of this stuff there this weekend or probably next week. Get some stuff done and get it done and you know make progress. So that's about it. Now I gotta move this green car, this 300 out of here and put the Camaro up on that trailer. So that's about it for right now. And um, all this 928 stuff that, that Tins Tinsdale Piranha gave me, I gotta go through it and uh, sort it, organize it, and get it out of the trailer. Because like a dum-dum, I put the transmissions in upside down stupid and it leaked oil everywhere so i've got a lot of dry sweep in there right now soaking that stuff up but uh, it's still you know it leaked out on the ground so i'm really dumb stupid me 
So, gotta clean all that up, take each item out, dust it off. This is crazy. Oh well. Such is life, you make mistakes. Tschüss! So, that camera's got little shavings on it of uh, metal. So, all right, out of here. Bye.